Valentino here with College 411. We are bringing you the inside scoop with every single thing UTSA tailgate. Starting to fill up here. People are starting to barbecue, have fun. Everyone's cooking, getting ready for the game. It's excitement in the air for those Red Runners. So let's go get the 411. College 411. We're here to get the 411 with Joe Ryan Nagel with Kins 5. Joe, how are you? Are you excited about the game today? Katie, I'm so excited I can't stand it. It ought to be a lot of fun. They won last week, so there's a lot of momentum going in. I'm fired up and everybody is, it looks like, right? Oh yeah, it's real exciting. They are out here since 8 in the morning getting excited for everything. So who are you looking out for today on the team? Well, you know, I'm looking out for a lot of guys because there should be a lot of new guys play, so a lot of the young guys. But, you know, you got to look at the quarterback, right? Eric So, so he's the guy, right? And it, So if he does well, the team does well. So Great. It'll be fun. And you think it's going to be a good season overall? I think so. I think they should be 2-0 and after today. They should win today. In fact, they will win today. It's a guarantee. All right, you heard it here first. All right, so they'll be 2-0, and and, and we'll be ready to roll. There it is, guys, from the sportsman himself. So we have good things coming. Thank you, Joe. Thank you. Enjoy Katie. the game. Thank you, too. Thank you. Here we are with College 411 Magazine, DJ BJ spinning it live. And I think we all get a pretty good feeling about today. UTSA Roadrunners inaugural game, we're ready bringing you live coverage. I'm here with some guys from Kappa Sig. We've got Ash, Rito, and Brian. You guys excited for the game? Yeah, we are. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about your organization first. Uh, we're Kappa Sigma fraternity. Uh, we are a um, 15-year-old fraternity on campus. We're over 100 years old nationally. Um, we uh, take value in our four pillars, scholarship, leadership, fellowship, and service. So That's really great. We like to hear about these organizations helping out the community. So I heard you guys prepared a little cheer for us. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Right. One, two, three. We rock the U. We rock the T. We rock the S. We rock the A. We rock the U. T. S. A. U. T. S. A. We rock it all day. We rock it all day. Hi, everybody. Cassandra Tolentino here with College 411, bringing you the inside behind the Sigma Pi fraternity tailgate. We're here with the president, Alex Calloway. He's going to tell us a little bit about what's what we're cooking up behind here in the tailgate. What's going on? Well, we got about uh, 30 pounds of meat going. We got a whole brisket, a pork butt, and a uh, feed of chicken meat, so it should be good. What would you say is the most essential thing and anything that makes your tailgate? Preparation. Preparation is key. How long have you guys been out here? I just got here. I've been trying to find the new uh, tailgating spot. But Essentially, how long does the brisket take to make? Uh, I've been cooking it all night. All night, so you would say 16 about hours. 16 hour brisket. It looks incredible. Uh, do you mind if we have a taste when it's done? Well, yeah, whenever we pull it out, it's warming up right now. So. Perfect, you guys, right here, Sigma Pi Tailgate, coming to you from College 411. Hey guys, I'm with here at College 401 and we have El Gran Beak. Look at that, guys. Isn't this exciting? Everyone's getting ready for the game. We had Ro Rowdy, the Roadrunner, but this guy's here. You got any cheers for us? Go Runners! and hamburgers here. I'm about to try filet mignon wrapped in bacon, jalapeno, shredded cheese, and um, it just looks like a whole ball of delicious things. <laughs> Fan right there, his own jersey and everything. Now, Mark's over here at the grill cooking up some good stuff. What have you got for us? 
We've got some filet mignon with some bacon wrapped with some cream cheese. We've got some pork here. We've got some steak there and some uh, chicken jalapeno mango sausage. This is amazing, guys. Look, look at this. Look at this guy. He is the guy to go to today. So he said he would let us have a try. Is that right? All right. I want to try one of these things. Bacon's one of my favorites. All right, guys. Right here. Let's put it to the test. All right. See what I think. Oh my gosh. I have like new lip gloss on. <laughs> it's so delicious. I'm glad you like it. Thank you, Mark. You have a good day. Sure, thanks. Go Roadrunners. Woo! Well, what FIRST is, is the foundation for inspiration and recognition of science and technology. And what we do is we inspire young people to become science and technology leaders in the future through a robotics competition. We have programs from kindergarten to 12th grade, and today we have our, our high school kids out here with our large robots. Right. Here's what's going on in San Antonio, America. We've got UTSA with their startup football program. We've got the best engineering school in America, UTSA Roadrunner Engineers. Woo! We're over here, we've got our high school kids, we've got our College of Engineering kids, we've got our alumni, and we got the best football this side of the Mississippi River. We're shooting t-shirts, we're shooting basketballs, we're throwing footballs. This is all about fun, this is all about coming to San Antonio. You do not want to miss this party. And I'm telling you, the football, it's strangely compelling. You gotta love the Roadrunners. Go Roadrunners, woo! Thank you. All right. <laughs> Dr. Romo himself, what an honor as a student at UTSA to be here broadcasting this event live. And we just wanted to ask you a couple questions. How does this season, you feel, compare spirit-wise from last year? It's going, to be, it's going to be more spirit than last year because we're getting the hang out of it. But you know what? It's hard to match what happened last year because everybody, like a first time, they got really pumped up. They got the crowd into the game. But it's going to be as good or better because we got a little bit more veterans there to do it. Absolutely, and the entire community is involved. Um, us having the only football team in San Antonio is just incredible. It brings everybody out. And how do you feel about coming out to the game and seeing the entire community behind UTSA? Well, first, it's great to have the best football team in San Antonio and beyond many miles. So we are, we're excited about this new season for us. We're going into the WAC. We're going to be playing with some veterans. Got a few more. Got a couple of more seniors on the team. Uh, I feel really good about this season, and I think the fans will be very good and happy uh, about what we're going to do. I do as well, you guys, and it's going to be an incredible season. You saw it here first. One more thing, Dr. Romo. Show us your best football touchdown dance. Ready, go. Uh, touchdown ah. dance. All right, I don't know what I would do. U-T-S-A. U-T-S-A, everybody. Get rowdy. Turnout, ate lots of incredible food, had a great time, and our voices are gone. Our voices are gone.
are completely gone. Now we're ready to head into the game and continue our rowdiness. I'm Cassandra Tolentino. I'm Katie Rivera. And I'm Madeline Mendoza. And we're College 411, where we school you in everything college. Hi, this is Katie from College 411, and we're here to get the 411 with John Reinagle of a Kim Joe Reinagle. Let's start over one more time. Joe. <laughs> oh, I have to see. Okay. <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> like, what's going on here? 